Now that the school year has wound down, it's camp season for young athletes in our community. A new camp was held today at Auburn High School, this one run by an NFL player. Auburn alum and Minnesota Vikings tackle Vidarian Lowe. Lowe has the weekend off between his own camp sessions in Minnesota with the Vikings. What better way to spend the weekend than by reaching out to youngsters in his hometown? So how are you doing? What's up, man? This has been something that me and my grandfather have talked about for years. I feel like this time is right now. Um, I feel like I've established myself a little bit. I feel like I've been put in a position. You know, um, kids look up to pro athletes, and um, this is what it's all about. Everybody goes on the whistle. Boys and girls between the ages of 7 and 11 were put through a series of agility drills. Keep your feet moving, keep your feet moving, keep, keep your feet, feet moving. moving. Just get it out too much, get out too much. Take off. Hit it hard, hit it hard, hit it hard, hit it hard. Boom. Right up, right up, right up. Sports is for everybody. You know, this is for, they're there for everybody, you know, boys, boys and girls. You know, football is a game where you just come out, you know, run, stretch your legs, um, show your agility, show your speed. On three, we say Vidarian low, all right? Okay? One, two, three. All right, go to your next station, guys. Lowe wasn't the only Minnesota Viking at Auburn. He brought three of his teammates with him, fellow offensive linemen Ed Ingram and Josh Sokol and tight end Nick Muse. Lowe was great about interacting with the kids, throwing some passes. He showed them how NFL linemen develop their strength and endurance by doing the rope drill. Then it was the kids' turn. There you go, I know you're tired. Come on, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing through. He even took time out for a friendly competition of rock, paper, scissors. Next came a group photo. Say cheese. All right, here we go. One, two, three, hold that. All the campers received t-shirts, and at the end, they got autographs from a real NFL player. So this is something you would like to do every year? Oh, 100%. Yeah, 100%. I'm already ready for next year. I'm sure those kids are too. They had a great time. Well, the White Sox were trying to stay on.